What's going on, my people? So I got a story to tell. Uh, you know, everybody knew I was coming to Spain. And as I was speaking to my friends, everyone was telling me different things to check out, um, Gaudi and all these other things. One puffy-haired bell friend in particular uh, kept telling me about this light. <laughs> This blinking light, but you wouldn't tell me what it was. Follow the blinking light, follow the blinking light, follow the light. I get to Barcelona, every single person I ask about this blinking light is like, what are you talking about? No idea, I've been laughed at, I've been cracked on, my neighbor at my apartment, it's been a running joke. Have you found the light? Are you going towards the light? Don't go to sleep because you might go towards the light. So, you know, for a couple of days I'm staying at a hotel still no one knows what the hell I'm talking about with this light everyone has an idea maybe it's the water fountain maybe it's the church maybe it's this maybe it's that but nothing about a blinking light so today I walk out of my hotel room turn the corner onto the big avenue and what is it that I see I'm not sure why the zoom isn't working this time, but before it got like really close and you could actually see the fucking blinking light. It's some type of tower, I have no idea what the hell it is. But I am going to follow the light now and the next video will be me at the light. And All right, Belle, thank you. I, I believe you, I'm sorry. The fucking blinking light. Absolutely. Hola. Hola, Belle. So as promised, the next video, <laughs> was going to be of me going towards the light. So I made it to Tibidabo, which is the name of the train station, also the name of the mountaintop where the flashing light is. But once you take the train there, you have to take a train, a trolley, an old school trolley, up to the top of the mountain. So, you know, I get to Tibidabo. I'm waiting for the train for about, I'd say a little more than an hour for a train they say comes every 10 to, excuse me, 15 to 30 minutes um, with a few other people. We're waiting, we're waiting. <laughs> Finally, someone reads the sign again and realizes, oh, the train stops going in the afternoon. It's only an early morning thing, and the park is closed. And anyone who's been here knows we don't get out of bed until 2, so I don't know who this attraction was for. So unfortunately, uh, this is the end of my ride, because I can't get to the light. <laughs> um, I guess I'll have to do it another time. At least tomorrow. Or maybe I'll get someone to uh, drive me up. We'll, we'll see how that goes. So hopefully there will be a part three with my creative way to get to the top of the mountain. And if not, this is the end of it. But, Bell, I did try to get to the light. I really did try. Hasta luego.